Welcome back, attractive and well-educated watchers, to a brand new episode of Last Fan Colony here on RimWorld. Last time we left off, uh, we were chilling. However, in between the break, we made a decision. We are going to take down that sunblocker. Because, well, our animals are starving. And our Rottweilers are starving. And our elephants are starving. And that just cannot be allowed. So, here we are. So if you're excited to see what happens today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all the other various different places we do stuff. Support us there. Share this video anywhere you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watch, go on down to our Patreon via that link tree link in the description. Pledging just $1 a month to help support the cause. And join the mighty, mighty ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time. And Toll Pains are our number one watcher of all time. And uh, get your name in the game. That's right, this game. Because as you can see at the top left, we name our colonists after patrons. As you can see here, we've got ten battle droids, all ten of our battle droids, and one elephant traveling to this stupid sunblocker to destroy it. Because after all, we will not allow things to go worse. We just got uh, solar panels and we're moving slowly toward the harp and then toward really, really, really good weapons. Once we get really, really, really good weapons, we will... Almost certainly arm all of our battle droids with, like, miniguns and heavy machine guns and stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty exciting. We went past this ancient call... Uh, maybe. That's not what the goal is here. So, yeah. Got uh, less than a day. Uh, all those droids have a shit ton of batteries with them, so it's all good. And then on the way back... Hmm. Okay, whatever. Yeah, we are on the way back. Going to undoubtedly do whatever we can to uh, pick up stuff. Shall remove this roof. Ooh, turquoise. And that will allow us to clear out everything that we really want. <clears throat> we have uh, now more fields than ever. There's just one problem. There's no sun. And you see that? That's not going to be allowed. So, uh, yeah. Things going well. Laz Pev consuming a bowl of stew. We're working on stew now. We've decided to up our game with stew, tea, coffee, and pemmican. Of which we actually, wow, almost have all of the pemmican that we're looking for. And we have all the stew that we're looking for. So, as before, at least the people have plenty of food. It's our poor animals that are paying the price now. And we cannot allow that. Only one Rottweiler is presently starving. But we simply cannot take the, uh, take the risk. One day we'll make another colony. A secondary location, the likes of which has never been seen. We're thinking this down here is going to be, like, wreck and stuff, maybe? We don't know. I don't have anything out here anymore. We will probably make something out of these things eventually. Let me just get rid of that. How you doing, Toll? Looking pretty decent, actually. Right, one moment, we're just gonna... Styling table. Oh, we already have a styling table. Okay, well. One moment. Oh, jeez. Uh... Who wants a look change?
Somebody wanted a look change, right? A without table. Oh, we guess they can just do it by themselves now. That makes sense. Gatomia's right back on it. Having recently got a uh, skilled trainer, Gatomia now rocks at 10 intelligence. A.K.A. a skilled professional. Somebody that you would be perfectly fine doing your science for you. And as you can see, gets that sewage sludge composting done somewhat decently. Biosolids composter. After that, mmm, the good guns. And then, the really good guns. <laughs> Uh, we're getting steel back. That was low before. Point two days. Oh boy, oh. So there they're gonna work it. We've got to clear this uh, sun blocker just so that our animals can survive. Because animals are our power. Oh boy. Here we go. It's a coming. It's a getting there. Literally just on the very outside bit. You suck. Come on! Alright. And, and surprisingly, uh, like... Surprisingly, all of the dogs are like... Dogs, like, super well-trained, snap our fingers, they do a little, a little pyramid, like the, the 90s Chinese acrobat team, you know, like, wacha, and then you snap your fingers again and they attack, <laughs> like you do. They are almost there. We are waiting. Waiting. Slowly but surely. And kablam! Caravan has arrived at the anomaly. Permanent gunshot injury. Whoa. Oof. We'll take care of that in no time at all. Alright, everybody be prepared for anything. What could be causing... All right, bucko. From a distance. Bring, bring it down. Why do you keep getting hit? This is an ancient complex. 
We'll take it since it's on the way back. Yup, send everybody. Now, let there be light. And it, it was good. Allow sewing. We are back, baby. Now, everybody, we'll go back to sowing the fields, and we will grow great and mighty foliage. All will be happy and well fed. The plants will return, the animals will rise, the solar network will be made. It's going good. It's going real good. And the pen am animals will be happy. It's only a matter of time until everything is back the way it was and the way it should be. As you can see, the robots, robot, robot, are already filling all of the pl uh, correct places. Soon, we will have ground all of the stuff back to normal. We will get our sludge composting. We will get our harp. Lazpev will become a dame or a duke or a, a knight or whatever. It'll be great. Everybody will be happy. Everybody! <laughs> it would make sense that birch trees would grow in the pitch dark. You frickin' would, birch tree. This is pretty nice, though. Pretty sure our animals are gonna... are gonna find something to eat. Not too terribly long. Okay, bamboo's being planted in mass. Palamus became a guest. Go trade with Palamus. Alternatively, he said, how about you trade with Palamus? That's fine. We don't really care. We want to give you a gift. And that gift will be... Sushi. There we go. Boom. Done. Just wanted to see where we were with you. Kablam. A pack of man-hunting chihuahuas! My gods. How threatening and in need of immediate and complete destruction. Alright, well. Back to it then, we suppose. Let's go see what's at that ancient complex. All the while, slowly building up more and more agriculture once again. Boom. Quartz plants. Coffee. Tea. Eventually move on to onions. Things are going very, very quickly, and we like this a lot. Very, very quickly. And we love it. As we said, once the sun comes back out, 
We will go, we will rise more mighty than ever before. Nothing will stop us. Onions, everything. Fallen Empire. Nobody cares about them. Okay, it's not entirely true. Oh, wow. They'll, uh, they'll take a lot of stuff from us. Well, then, in that case, this is just a good opportunity. Alright. Uh, do you have anything for us, by chance? Nah. Let's give them... Uh, a bit of a gift. 53. Mm, rough. We'll just slap down some tilled soil for our weed crop there. Mmm, look at him go. Build that tilled soil. And then... And then this... Shall grow pepper plants? And this growing zone shall grow peas, and this growing zone shall grow, uh, silver flowers. Maybe a moment. T should do we hops for beer, and this one, this tiny little guy here, uh, we're gonna say this tiny little guy here. Does like tobacco. Actually, no, we don't like tobacco. Screw that. This one will make silver. Excellent. Blah, blah. quartz. Okay. <clears throat> so silver's just gonna give us a little boost every now and then. Ain't no big thing. Alright. Now they're planting all of our weed, like they should. Hmm. Grass will have to grow there in due time. Planting rice. Eventually, this will all be great. It has been raining forever, though. Our watermelon. Floors. A little bit of cotton that we've got. Spineapples. Strawberries. Grapes, potatoes. Alright. Alright, we actually think we are officially back on the groove now. A 
Like, officially. That's fine. Grass is growing quickly. In very, very short order, the pasture will be pastory again. Our dog is snoring right under the table. If you hear something grindy and sawmilly, that's what it is. Yep. That would be the thing. Alright, they're planting watermelons. They've already planted all the rice. They've already planted all the cotton. They're moving on to spine apples. Oh, we did guest. Okay. Yup, and gradually... Oh! Oh! Kitchen bots coming in clutch! We don't need that. Already planted, like, a whole field of rice? Oh, dear. Clearly, then... Gonna change these over to carrots. We do not believe we have carrots. You gotta have them root vegetables. Highest sugar content of any rooty, rooty. Any root vegetable at all. Carrots. Don't let anybody spread the false gospel of the parsnip to you saying that they were sweeter than carrots. They're not. They don't even come close to the sugar content. Parsnips are false gods. Alright, got our spine apple fields down. Now moving on to hay, the second hay grass field for this area here. One moment. Alright. Boom. That'll help with that. Don't worry, they will at some point eat the delicious grass presently growing. And then, before you know it, all of our animals will be happy again and productive. Everything will be good. Yeah, that sunblocker really screwed us up. We were hoping to wait it out, and it just, it was not going to work. Oh, jeez, we still have more. Okay, one moment. Come on now. Uh, cabbages. Actually, no, this is a little too small. We're instead going to... Have them be gold ferns. We don't care. And then... This will be cabbages. It will be my cabbages! As you can probably imagine. Alright, boom! Even more. Are we missing anything? Not yet. We're going to eventually put something here. Something here. And maybe something here. But maybe not, we don't know. Yes, yeah, slowly but surely... We are now having to regrow the grass. Oh, geez, right, you're like almost there. Generating map for new encounter. <clears throat> We've arrived at the ancient complex. Oh. Oh! Okay, one moment. Checking this out. It's looking. Okay, all of them are dead. Snacky is dead. All right, scrubs, come on this way, but do not get close enough that it can fire at you. 
If we are going to enter this complex, we need to enter it correctly. Ha! We'll be long gone before that's there. There. All right. Should we? Alright, we are close. Let's go in, come what may. Hermetic crate? Get out! Open fire! Go, go, go! Oh, jeez! Okay. Open the hermetic crate. Security crate. All right. Linked to supply satellite. Generator. Maybe let's not. All right. A joy wire? Heck yeah! Joy wires are great. Kaboom! Come on out, scrub, make our day. Ha! <laughs> Burn in death. All right, all right. Let's be real. This is all fun and everything, but... Should probably just destroy this thing. Ha! My, really? Ooh. Vegan egg substitute. Yay. We were so lucky.
Yeah. Was a bit of a waste of time, wasn't it? That's fine. Yeah. We guess we picked up an extra elephant along the way. Alternatively, our elephant gave birth along the way. Oh, look at that! Uh, grapes getting planted, potatoes are all planted, onions are all planted. Well, potatoes aren't all planted, but they will. They will get all planted. This right here is a colony worth living at. Consuming a day, Lily. Good job. He's doing his part. Kablam. War Merchant? Ooh, we tend to like War Merchants. But they're all tribal, so they're probably not going to be great War Merchants. Okay, soon, soon, the droids will move on to this hay grass in here. Everything will be awesome. Holy bejesus. We have, uh, we've been sleeping on the job, it looks like. Guess our hunting pack will have to go down and do it the old-fashioned way. By killing them. Well, killing them very well. It is looking like... Things are probably going to be completely solid. We believe that soon... The grass will grow back. The shrubs will be edible. The goats will eat. And everything, once again, will be happy and grand. As you can see, the kitchen bots are already doing their jobs. Slowly but surely, this entire colony will right itself. And when it does, we shall be more powerful than uh, we have ever imagined. As we said, coming out of this destructive sun-blocking garbage, we shall rise greater than ever before. Yes. Oh, yes. Nice. That's fine. We don't need any more goats right now. Come to this war merchant and see what they got. Good. Good. Oh, it is only a matter of time. Yeah, 46% grown. Yeah, this grass is growing pretty fast. In a couple days, despite hungry animals, rattlesnake in animal pen. That's not gonna fly. <laughs> oh! Oh, they're just tame rattlesnakes. Okay, well that's considerably less concerning. You only have longbows. This is fine. We didn't actually expect you to have anything. It's nice for you to come by. Yeah, they're they're the safe rattlesnakes. Got it. All right. Oh, there's our cabbages. Yeah, don't do that. Oh, 
Okay, they're on the way back. That's good. Tomatoes. No, cow cow. Oh, look, the, the grass, it's growing. It's growing really, really well, though. Oh. Okay, now they're planting the olives. We are just glad to see all of this again. You know, everything properly, everything. We're gonna change this over. This will be the pea plant. And this will be the pepper plant. As it occurs to us that we will find more to use from peas than peppers. Kablam! As you can see, we're getting our olive orchards up and running. All is going according to at least the new plan. Yeah, to provide enough grass. You mean to provide any grass? That's the problem. There was no grass at all. The entire place. It sucked. But we have destroyed the sunblocker and checked out the ancient ruins, which, as it so happens, only gave us some crappy vegan food. So we decided to just leave that. As you do. But we got some nice medicine. There's that. Alright. Yes, they're working on the hay grass. Long be well fed our animals. I'm making carrots there. Good. Heel root is growing. Yes! Full agrarian masterpiece. Once again, fellas. That's what we're talking about. And while we are at it. Let's just do what we originally set out to do. Two more places. This one, which will give us the glory of, uh, presumably, something we don't have? Kiwis. Right. And this one, this one shall give us the majesty of... Uh, Uh, we don't know, man. Um, this one shall give us the majesty of agave, right? As one does. And now, now there, our animals will eventually be okay. No, there's grass all around. It's there. Honest. Oh, jeez. Yeah, things are uh, things are indeed going rough. They are going pretty rough. Don't worry. It will be okay. They will get done here. They will immediately start planting the agave. Yeah. And once they're done finishing with the agave, they'll move on and finish absolutely everything else, just like they're supposed to. A match made in heaven. Re-agriculturalizing. Ok, 
Okay, well, our... Our sow is alive, apparently. Yeah, this is definitely going to be just fine in a couple of days in-game. So we don't really think we have to... Okay, yep, yep, cows are already eating. And it works. Oh, it works. Yes, okay. Sow, go away. Who cares? Nobody cares. Aren't you... Whatever, doesn't matter. Uh, yes, very excited. Okay, Shear will feed the sow some kibble. Alright, alright, and here we go, there they are, planting kiwis, sweeping across, we think this is going to be pretty good, next time you come back, the uh, battle droids will be back, if you liked what you saw today, here, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel, go on down to our link tree link in the show, oh, yeah, oh, okay, uh, right, no, right, we have to... Okay, no, we don't have to form a caravan. Yet. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yep, alright. And then everybody just goes back to their normal, as requested, everything. So all is well. Alright, and we got, uh, we got a joy wire, right. Unloading elephant cuff. <clears throat> yeah, we got a joy wire. That's pretty, pretty exciting. I should probably go to either Tiro or Tollpanzer, knowing how things work around these around these parts. Let's also look at. You can go with Shear. It's been a while since we checked on this, so we should at least you know, take care of the basics. Wow, though, uh, jeez, we didn't, we didn't realize that we were basically done with all of our training. Uh, okay, there, that, that's, that's a thing, we guess. Yeah, we can actually kill these. We don't want that many hyper weavers. So, uh, yeah, yeah. If you, uh, if you liked what you saw today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all the other play various different places we do stuff. Support us there. Share this video anywhere you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well educated watch, go on down to our Patreon via that link tree link in the description and pledge even just one dollar a month to help support the cause and join the mighty mighty ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time, and Toll Panzer, our number one watcher of all time, and get your name in the game. That's right, this game because after all, we uh we name our because after all, we name our uh, colonists after our patrons. Thanks a bunch for coming, everybody. Stay safe, stay inside, stay healthy, and of course, remember to help each other. Bye!